William Murphy was born in Detroit, Michigan on September 2nd, 1973. His name is linked to gospel music, worship, and spiritual guidance. Musician, preacher, and gospel artist Murphy is very good at what he does. His journey combines the strength of music and faith. Inspiring many people all over the world, his life has a lot to do with the history of church music and how dedicated he was to service. His path into music and ministry started in the middle of Detroit, a city famous for its musical history. Murphy became interested in music early on because he grew up in a family that was very religious in the church. A well-known preacher was his father, Dr. William H. Murphy Saar, and in the Church of God in Christ Kojek, his grandpa, Bishop William, was also a well-known minister. This strong base in faith and spirituality set Murphy up for his deep link to gospel music and his future career. When Murphy was growing up, he heard a lot of hymns, praise songs, and powerful sermons. This made him love music and worship right away. His family not only helped him figure out what to do, but they also inspired him to use music to bring people closer to God. In the church, he was surrounded by talented singers and musicians. This immersive experience had a big impact on his musical style and spiritual attitude. When William Murphy went to Georgia State University to study music, his creative path became more organized. They helped him improve his natural skill and learn more about the technical side of his job. Murphy heard a lot of different kinds of music at Georgia State. He also learned how to mix traditional church with modern styles to make a sound that appeals to both older and younger people. William Murphy, who has won a lot of praise, has become a big name in modern church music. His voice is strong and soulful, and he mixes traditional gospel sounds with current worship styles to make music that people all over the world really connect with. People all over the country became familiar with him after his first record, All Day, came out in 2005. It was the start of an amazing career that has had a big impact on the gospel. The release of William Murphy's first record, All Day, in 2005 marked the beginning of his rise to national fame. Praise is what I do, the album's first big hit, quickly became a praise song played in churches and other religious events all over the country. The lyrics of the song, which show a strong, unwavering dedication, won Murphy a lot of praise and cemented his place in the gospel music business. Murphy would continue to push the limits of gospel music throughout his career, writing songs that not only encourage, but also challenge and excite their listeners. The success of All Day was the start of this journey. He became a major voice in gospel and worship music because of how passionate and sincere he could make his music. After his first album did well, Murphy put out a string of important albums that made him even more of a figure in the gospel music genre. With each record, he showed how much he had grown as a worship leader, songwriter, and artist, both in terms of style and content. The Sound 2011, this record, was a big step forward in Murphy's career. It showed that he can make a dynamic worship experience that both traditional gospel fans and modern worship fans will enjoy. He the sound included a group of songs that focused on deep worship and spiritual thought. Many people who like gospel music love this record because of Murphy's strong voice in the modern production. People were inspired to connect more deeply with their faith by the songs on this album, which had deep lyrics and catchy melodies, God Chaser 2014. This record showed even more how William Murphy had grown as a worship leader. There were many songs on God Chaser that encouraged Christians to get closer to God. One of the songs on the album, You Are My Strength, is a worship anthem that talks about devotion, persistence, and seeking God. Other songs on the album are also worship anthems that talk about these same things. Many people like this project because it captured the essence of worship by combining high energy praise with quiet, introspective prayer. Murphy's singing, which was full of feeling and conviction, carried each song and made an atmosphere that made you want to give up. Settle Here 2019 was one of his most profound records. It showed how his approach to worship music had grown and changed over time. The title track of the album, Settle Here, became a powerful anthem for churches because it spoke to believers' wish for God to be present in their hearts. Making a church experience that is lively and interesting, Murphy had a lot of spiritual knowledge and the songs on Settle Here showed it. They were mostly about giving up, changing, and longing for a divine meeting. Murphy's vocal range and musical versatility were shown off on this record. And it also cemented his position as a leader in the gospel worship movement is his skill to mix traditional gospel elements with modern rock music. His music is a tribute to the long history of gospel music while also incorporating current styles that younger people like. 
Through this mix of styles, Murphy has been able to reach a wide range of people, bringing together people of all ages and backgrounds through his music. His live shows are more proof of how strong his voice is and how well he can lead worship. Every song Murphy sings, whether he's on stage or in the studio, shows how much he loves worship. His music not only makes people feel things, but it also has a spiritual power that inspires and changes people's lives. In the world of religious music, William Murphy has done a lot of great things and show how important he was as an artist and prayer leader. Not only has his music touched people all over the world, but it has also earned him praise in the gospel music business. Murphy has won many awards and been nominated for many more over the course of his career, confirming his place as one of the greats of modern gospel music. The Stellar Awards, which are sometimes just called the, have recognized Murphy's work in the field many times. He has been recognized for and won awards for his outstanding work in leading worship, singing gospel music, and writing songs. His success at the Stellar Awards shows that he has a special gift for writing songs that move people deeply and encourage them to connect with their faith. Besides the Stellar Awards, Murphy has also won the GMA Dove Awards, which are given for successes in Christian and gospel music. The Dove Awards honor musicians whose music spreads messages of faith, love, and hope. Murphy's music has always been about these things. His nominations and wins at the Dove Awards show how important he is in the Christian music world as a whole, not just in gospel music. William Murphy's influence goes beyond his success in the music business. He also made a difference as the founder and leader of the Dream Center Church of Atlanta. Murphy wanted to build a place where people could pray and grow spiritually. The church is the result of that dream. His work as a leader at the Dream Center shows a strong dedication to helping people in the neighborhood. People know the Dream Center Church of Atlanta for its lively church services that focus on having a personal relationship with God. Murphy's way of doing ministry goes beyond what you might normally do at church. He focuses on making a space where people can truly experience spiritual change. A lot of the time, his messages are about hope, having a mission, and how faith can help you get through hard times. As Murphy leads the Dream Center Church of Atlanta, one of its main goals is to reach out and help people in the community. Murphy has always thought that the church should be more than just a place to heal spiritually. He thinks it should also be a source of hope and support for the people it serves. Because of this belief, the church is very involved in many outreach projects that help people in need and give them power. Uh, there are groups that give out food, help the homeless, teach people how to get jobs, and help kids with their schoolwork. For Murphy, the church should be more than just a place to pray. It should also be a place where people can get help and support to make their lives better. Serving the community shows that he believes faith should be acted upon and that the church should be an important part of solving social problems. William Murphy's work at the Dream Center is more than just worship and community outreach. It also puts a lot of emphasis on people's mental growth. He really wants to teach and help people figure out who they are in Christ and how to live out their faith with courage and purpose. In many of his lectures, he urges Christians to grow closer to God and live a life of honesty, faith, and service. The Dream Center's many organizations like youth programs, adult Bible studies, and leadership training all focus on spiritual growth. People who go through these programs will be given the tools they need to deal with life's problems while keeping true to their faith. Because Murphy has been a leader in this area, a strong group of Christians who are passionate about living out their faith in real life has grown. William Murphy is well known for both his work as a gospel singer and as an energetic praise leader. His live performances and collaborations have had a big impact on the modern worship movement. Uh, Murphy has left a legacy that goes beyond recorded music. He is known for his strong singing, honest lyrics, and real worship experience. Tens of thousands of Christians attend his live prayer events. He is looking for a greater relationship with God and his work with other gospel artists has helped shape and grow modern worship music. People love William Murphy's live worship events because they have an electrifying atmosphere and a deep spiritual effect. There are more than just musical acts at these events. They are worship events. They are worship events that pull people in and allow them to meet God in a way that changes them. Many people in the gospel music community look forward to Murphy's live shows because he can lead worship with emotion and sincerity. One thing that makes Murphy's live events stand out is that he tries to make people feel comfortable talking about their faith in an honest and enthusiastic way. He wants the people in the crowd to take part, which turns the performance into a group act of worship instead of a one-sided show. This open-minded approach has made worshipers feel more united, bringing together people from all walks of life to raise their voices in praise, additionally to his powerful live performances. 
William Murphy has worked with many gospel acts, making a big contribution to the modern worship movement. He is willing to work with others, which has led to collaborations with some of the most important names in gospel music, adding to his sound and reaching more people in the business. Murphy's work with Tasha Cobbs Leonard, a superstar in modern church music, is one of his most well-known partnerships. On songs like Break Every Chain, they've used their combined skills to make powerful worship songs that are heard in churches all over the world. Murphy's skill at bringing out the best in other artists' voices shows how much he cares about spreading the word of worship. Some well-known names in church music, such as Donald Lawrence, Kirk Franklin, and Jonathan Nelson, have worked with Murphy. Murphy's impact in the gospel community has grown thanks to these collaborations. They have also helped the contemporary worship movement move forward by adding new sounds and lyrics to the genre. Through his work with these artists, he has made music that speaks to modern worshipers by combining old-fashioned church sounds with modern rhythms and melodies. William Murphy has made more than just music and live shows for the modern worship movement. The ideas behind them come from his view of worship as a way of life. His impact on modern worship can be seen in how gospel music has changed over time to include more sounds, styles, and themes that appeal to a wider range of people. His focus on making worship events that are easy to understand, fun, and life-changing has helped change what gospel music means to Christians today. Murph has also done a lot to spread the idea that modern worship can bring people of different generations and cultures together through his music and service. Both new and old gospel music fans like his sound, which is a mix of traditional gospel elements and modern worship inspirations. This mix of styles has helped make modern praise music more popular in Christian music, so more people can listen to it. William Murphy is known for his strong faith and powerful praise songs. He has also been through tragedies that have put his faith and strength to the test. Murphy has had a lot of highs and lows on his road, even though he is a successful gospel singer and spiritual leader. The death of family members, especially his mother in 2014, has been one of the hardest things he has had to go through. It has had a huge effect on his life and faith. William Murphy lost one of the most important people in his life when his mother died after a long fight with cancer. Losing this person was not only a terrible thing for Murphy, but it also changed his faith and the way he saw life. A big part of his life was his mother. She shaped his morals, his love of music, and his spiritual path. Losing her left a hole that couldn't be filled easily. Murphy has been very open about the pain and grief he felt after his mother died, calling it one of the hardest times of his life. Through her death, he lost more than just a mom. He also lost a spiritual and personal leader. He had always looked to his mother for support and guidance, so when she died, it was a terrible blow that made him question his faith. The death of Murphy's mother had a big effect on his music and service. As he grieved and thought about his life, he found a deeper connection to God and a stronger sense of meaning in his calling. Some of his most moving songs came from his pain. He used his feelings to make music that spoke to the problems and hopes of other people going through similar things. Murphy's songs became more open and vulnerable as he talked about his battles with faith, doubt, and finding peace after losing someone close to him. His listeners connected with his raw honesty, and many of them found comfort in the fact that even someone as religiously grounded as Murphy went through times of pain and doubt has given hope to many people who have been through their own struggles with loss and sadness. In the days after his mother died, William Murphy's faith was both tested and strengthened. He has often talked about how the pain of losing his mother made him trust God even more. Murphy didn't let his sadness take over his life. Instead, he used it to grow in his faith. He was looking for God's help and comfort in a way he had never done before. Murphy's road through grief has also changed the way he leads the Dream Center Church of Atlanta. Because of this, he is more understanding and compassionate, and he knows the deep pain and worries that come with loss. In his sermons, he often talks about his own battles with grief and doubt, taking the time to make sure that people who are hurting feel seen and understood. Many people look to Murphy for hope because he is honest about his pain and keeps his faith even after losing loved ones. His story shows how faith can help you get through even the worst times. It also serves as a reminder that even though we may go through hard times, we are never alone in our pain. People are still encouraged by William Murphy's music, ministry, and personal story to stay strong in their faith, find strength in God, and think that there is always hope even when bad things happen. Many people with depression fight a quiet battle that no one else sees. Millions of people around the world suffer from depression. For William Murphy, it was the same thing. 
Murphy was known as a strong and inspiring leader in the church music community, but there were times when things were really bad that not many people could see. He was mentally ill because of all the work he had to do as a gospel singer and as the leader of the Dream Center Church of Atlanta. So Murphy has been open about how the stress of running a church and keeping up with his music business made his depression worse. He often felt too busy to do everything that was expected of him, but he kept inspiring people through his songs and lectures. He felt like he had to be strong all the time for his family and community, which made it hard for him to admit that he needed help. When William Murphy decided to talk about his sadness in public, it was a turning point, but also as a leader in the church community. He broke the quiet that surrounds mental health problems, especially among religious people, by telling his story. Being open about his experiences has helped break down the shame that comes with getting help for mental health problems, which has inspired others to do the same. Murphy has stressed how important it is to understand that mental health problems do not mean you don't have faith or are spiritually weak. They are just a part of being human, something that even the most devoted believers may go through. He has made his word clear to those who follow and listen to him. Getting help is not a sign of failure, it's a step toward getting better and healing. He tells people to talk to mental health professionals, psychologists, or friends they can trust, reminding them that it's okay to ask for help when they are having a hard time. William Murphy has become a strong voice for mental health awareness, especially in faith-based groups after his own journey. He has used his fame to start talks about mental health, which has led to more open communication and understanding. Murphy thinks that dealing with mental health problems is not only a medical need, but also a moral duty since it means taking care of the whole person, mind, body, and soul. William Murphy has always been in the spotlight because he is a big name in gospel music. Fans, critics, and people in the church community as a whole have been watching his every move. Because he is so well known, he has had to deal with the special challenges of being closely watched by the public over his personal choices in both his music and his ministry. Artists in the gospel genre are often held to high moral and spiritual standards, so any mistake that people think they have made can lead to criticism or judgment. Murphy has been honest about how hard it is to live under such close scrutiny. He has talked a lot about how hard it is to keep up a perfect image that meets the needs of his fans and the standards of the church music community. These demands can be too much to handle, especially when you're trying to find a balance between being yourself and how other people see you. Murphy has felt the need to be a source of strength and inspiration for others, which has made it hard for him to show weakness or accept that he is having problems. People have chosen for Murphy to accept himself as a person and be honest about his flaws and mistakes. A famous person like him knows that being famous doesn't mean he can't make mistakes or have problems. By talking about his own problems and flaws, he has made it possible for other people to feel accepted and understood, even if they don't live up to religious or social standards. Murphy's honesty has also inspired other people in the gospel music business to be more open about how they deal with stress, burnout, and the difficulties of being watched by many people. His voice has become a voice for mental and emotional health, stressing that taking care of oneself is not a sign of weakness, but a necessary step toward achieving one's goals. For making him a strong figure in religious music and a leader in faith-based groups, he has become an example to many people who look to him for advice and support after going through personal loss, mental health problems, and the stresses of public life. William Murphy's life and work show how powerful it is to be strong, which comes from having a strong faith in God.